This is a tributary of Vaughn's Branch. It feeds into the Wolf Run watershed. Two years post-restoration, I'm very happy with how the project's turned out. The main reason the project was done was for water quantity improvement, so for flooding. And so the project has done a lot of that aspect. I have come down here numerous times after we've had really heavy, heavy rains, big flood events, and you don't see the water coming up near as much as it used to in the past. I think in a lot of respects we've exceeded a lot of those expectations that I had for this project. This has been a wonderful project to bring people out to and say, hey, in an urban area, we can do some really cool things like this. We're not limited just because we have roads nearby or homes. There's a lot of wonderful ecosystem services that projects like these can provide in an urban landscape. As you can see behind me, the vegetation's really starting to thicken up, grow in. As the project still matures, the biggest thing we're probably gonna notice really is the vegetation. Um, and by that I mean the trees are going to start to get bigger and we'll see, continue to see our flowers. So those are what we call perennial plants. They're going to come year after year. We have birds, we have squirrels, uh, chipmunks. We'll see ducks a lot of times. You'll see ducks in here. We also have a lot of people that use this area. So they like to look at it, they jog by it, they like to uh, see it visually appealing. I've been very happy with it and I'm really excited to see how the vegetation and the stream further develop uh, over the years. Now I have changed the way I teach my class, so at least 30 to 40 percent of my class is taught outside and I use this part of the stream a lot for it. We can survey, we can do all kinds of things in the stream and the students can learn firsthand about a project from beginning to end. The university I think has a wonderful opportunity with projects like this and others on campus to create these outdoor ecosystems but also to create more sustainable ecosystems.